you know, uh, it's a pretty scary situation when you wake up from a nap and you're tumbling through the air at 150 knots. I'll never forget, I can still see it in my, in my head, one of the load masters on a C-17 who had severe hyperventilation. The individual stuck out his, his hand and it looked like he was trying to point at something and instead he was hypoxic, so he actually collapsed. Uh, full, full on collapse and he was on his face and inside the aircraft. Hi, I'm Aaron Stark. So I'll be your trip lead for today. I'm going to go over your um, air crew briefing. Aircraft commander is responsible for and final authority to the operation of the aircraft according to AFI 11-202 volume 3. Notify a PT immediately of any concerns, oxygen equipment, or physiological symptoms. A PT will maintain the official... Sort you don't appreciate oxygen until you don't have oxygen. Life. Right away. Oxygen means life to me. I mean, it's... Uh, it's funny, I took a deep breath when you said that. HAMS is a, an extension of aerospace and operational physiology. It's part of that career field. What we do in HAMS is high altitude airdrop mission support. Our, our, our mission is essential to any real world or training mission where they're going to fly above 20,000 feet unpressurized. Every single mission is stressful. <laughs> Every single mission has you on edge, um, especially when the door opens. You have to disconnect people. They're getting off their off their consoles and they're getting ready. They're moving to the ramp. That's that's when it's time because you have that clock of now we're going to start counting down. We need to be able to have two minutes before we actually exit the aircraft. Absolutely, hypoxia can kill you. Um, let's say you exit from 20,000 feet, you're hypoxic, you never really wake up, your reserve parachute deploys at, at, at 1,500 feet, you, you ride under canopy into a big lake, and uh, you know, you never breathe again. You know, we're not the reason for the mission, but we're essential to the mission. Because we're the only guys who do this, um, you know, we need to be exceptional. Bottom line.